doing welcome back to a video where i'm going to be talking about two stocks not just our favorite one on this channel mmat mmtop and meta materials i'm going to be bringing one on your radio radar for you all to look at cosmos holdings ticker symbol cosm i'm back with a new stock so my name is odr if you don't know what it stands for own damn research it's the key to success know what you buy know what you hold i am not a financial advisor none of this is financial advice so i suggest you do your own damn research anyways let's get into it so i want to start off with mmat but before i do i want to quickly talk about cosmos holdings this stock has had crazy volume look at that 148 million volume out of nowhere this has been exploding the average million the average volume wasn't even at nearly 30 million it was literally at its low low hundred thousands low millions and now it's exploded so a lot of people are looking into this there could be a potential short squeeze next week or the weeks to follow this price could explode to a, a dollar and there's a lot of hype around this one um i'm just saying it now keep it on your radar because i could how i could see this play now i am not going to be buying it now at this current price but if i do see some sort of you know dip on monday when the stock market opens a little crash i might buy this at the i'm not going to sound bearish but if i do see this at what 25 to 33 cents i might start a position from there i might start a position around the 30 to 35 mark if i see it there and then average down but that's just me personally obviously do your own damn research because this one could be a swing trade buy in get out quick um it's a bit risky knowing how high it's gone and the volume that it's been getting like look at this from from just seven cents eight cents and then exploded out of nowhere within the last week but we'll get back into that so let's start off with mmat meta materials mmtop which to this day has not been disappointed if you do your own damn research if you've been following me for a while we've been talking about this when it was back a dollar below a dollar when it first came out and all that stuff and here it is still doing well things we love to see so if you don't know meta materials did announce some big key dates now i i am going to be uploading this video a bit late because of stuff that's been going on with a crypto um but yeah here i am meta materials board of directors approves planned completion of the spin-off next bridge hydrocarbons now we've got three key ready for monday ready for monday mmat meta materials and cosmos holdings keeping cosmos holdings on the radar naim odr but here we go this is the hype that i've been getting shorts must close MMTOP Meta Materials positions by December 9th. No expectations. A lot of people have been seeing this and sharing this information. Um, so it says Trade Zero Client symbol MMTOP Meta Materials preferred share will undergo a share spin off with the egg state listed as Monday, December 12th, 2022. Due to the circumstances and uncertain component of this corporate action. Remember, it's just another date. If it happens, it happens. If it doesn't, it doesn't. But let's see if the shorts start paying up baby um but yeah what i also wanted to give you the key days of was here like i said i love getting news from mmat news always sharing you know confirmed news rumors and all that stuff but this is confirmed news meta materials provides record and distribution date for their preferred shares transferring over to next bridge hydrocarbons so the record date is december 12th and the distribution date is going to be december 14th the source we have is on meta materials official website meta materials meta go be on so if you want to read for it just pause the video obviously this is probably a bit too late for me to upload um so you already probably know about this but i'm just going to quickly summarize it all we could even see a short squeeze mid-december like during this time december 10 to 20 i'm not trying to say it will happen but we might you never know because we're still expecting a massive short squeeze i know we're at the 10 dollar mark and all that stuff but i'm just saying but yeah subjects to certain conditions including among others completion of all necessary actions and filings with regard to applicable state securities or blue sky laws and final approval for which there can be no assurances that such approval will be given each holder of Series A preferred shared stock as of 4 p.m. on December 12, 2022, the record date for the distribution. December 12 is the record date for the distribution. Will be entitled to receive one share of Next Bridge Common Stock for every one share of Series A preferred stock held as of the record date. Remember, you can't sell right now. If you want this, you can't sell. You gotta have that magic word in you. You gotta be holding onto that magic word. And that magic word is, I already said it, hold. 
You gotta hold. You gotta have these diamond hands. Believe in yourself. Um, if you wanna sell, you sell. But if you wanna be entitled to this, you have to hold because there is a key date, 4 p.m. ET, December 12, 2022, which is literally like two weeks away. Um, but yeah, that's the record date. The shares of Next Bridge Common Stock will be distributed on December 14th. So the record date is December 12. The distribution date of when it comes out to you is December 14 after the closing of the trade market at which time all the series a preferred stock will be automatically cancelled and the holders of such a series a preferred stock will cease to have any right with respect to such shares and the shares of series a preferred stock mmtop will no longer be on the otc market as tradable you heard it again december 14 and december 12 the two key dates the one I want you all to know is holding from now to December 12th. You might see the ups, you might see the downs. You got to believe in yourself if you did your own research and look into this big news. You have to tell yourself, why are you holding? This news right here, this is confirmed news by the Meta Materials Company. Things we'll have to see. The short squeeze days, hopefully. But yeah, um, that's the big dates for MMTOP going forward. So price wise, I'm not going uh, like if uh, I'll be honest, if I see it go down, I don't really care because I'm on massive pro profits. Alhamdulillah. Um, yeah, I'm I'm happy on where I am right now with my profits. I'm pretty sure some of you all are as well. Most of you all are as well, because I've been covering this for a very long time and look how much it's exploded. Um, so profit wise, I know it's not an issue. Um, uh, what I was going to say If it goes down It goes down I don't really care If it goes up It goes up That's just a bonus That's how I see it If it goes down Cool Goes up Bonus Fair play Things you love to see MM80 Meta Materials uh, Let's just quickly look at that Before we move on So As always That's doing good When this was below a dollar By the way People were losing hope People were losing faith But end of October comes And here we go back up Back up on top Alright If you see a crash What do you do If you see a crash And you believe in a company What do you do You know yourself Um but yeah, let's move on to the hype that everyone's talking about. Cosmos Holdings. Now, Cosmos Holdings is a new stock I'm bringing on to this channel. Um, it is a risky one because of how much it spiked. Don't let other people tell you otherwise. You can already tell by you know the price action. It has gone crazy within the last two weeks, um, especially last week. Monday could be a big, uh, big day for this stock, Cosmos Holdings, especially next week. In fact, yeah, I'm just going to say it. next week's going to be a big week for this stock. Um, there's going to be a lot of attention with it. A lot of people buying in. A lot of people selling out for, to cash out profits. I'm going to be keeping an eye on this. If I see the price targets I want, I will be triggering that price and buying. So, Cosmos Holdings, the volume has gone insane. 148 million. Holy wow. Cosmos Holdings. Um, yeah, so this is the latest news. Wait, is this the latest one? I want to go in order. Let me just double check. Uh, Cosmos Health to sell this. Okay, yes, yeah, so this is the latest one. So Col Cosmos Health requests a pill from the Nasdaq. Okay, this ain't the latest one. The latest one's here. I'll start off from the beginning to the uh, latest one. So Cosmos Health requests a pill from the Nasdaq stock market. So um, November seventeenth, this news came out that this healthcare group, um, pharmaceuticals, OTC medications, and medical devices announced that on November tenth, twenty twenty two, which has gone. Cosmos Holdings received a non-compliance letter from the Nasdaq stock market for its failure to maintain a minimum closing bid price of 10 cents per share for 10 consecutive business days in accordance with Nasdaq listing rule. But look at the price now. Um, yeah, we already know about Nasdaq. Come on, Cosmos Holdings is going to be on Nasdaq. We know it. We know it. I, we know. I, it's not going. It's not going away. It's here for Nasdaq. Um, Cosmos also, yeah, I want to talk about this one because the third quarter 2022 fin financial results did come out on November 15th. Um, so revenues were 12 million versus 30 million in third quarter 2021. The decline in consolidated revenues was largely due to the high variation in FX differences between euros and Great British pounds and US dollars. Uh, gross margins were 14 8 14.8% versus 17.3% due to the increase in distribution business, which carries low lower gross margins. Uh, I'm just going to say by looking at the uh, earnings, you know, it's a company that's growing slowly. So give it time and you'll see it shining again. I'm not going to worry about the earnings. I'm just being honest. Me personally, I'm not going to worry about the earnings because I know this is a potential uh, day trade or swing trade or get in and out quick thing. Like it's a risky play for me. And 
I haven't been in a risky play for a very long time. Like I'm not really here for um, the long term. This is I'm gonna be honest. Like you have to be honest with yourself. Don't let, people that tell you they're in some stocks for the long term. I tell you now, some of them just say that just for you know you to believe them. But most people out there are just there for short term trade, get in and out. And I'm looking at Cosmos Holdings as a get in and out for me. Like I could see a potential short squeeze here, and if I see a dollar mark, that's you know crazy like i'll happily take a dollar mark price um but yeah i don't want to end the video there i want to quickly talk about this because cosmos holdings has actually been getting big insiders buying at high prices including seven dollars which i'm seeing all over twitter so the person who bought 15 million shares is lender back in 2021 for three million when the price was above three dollars no he believes that something big is about to happen si over 700 percent 1 billion trading volume for short week of a 10x float. Um, it's about to break the weekly trend, break the 57 uh, cents mark to potentially hit the $1 mark. Short covering will send this to 5 to $9 in this person's opinion. Now, I ain't going to say 5 to $9 next week. If it happens, it happens. Fair play. I am looking at that $1 mark. That's what I want to look at. Just double the price. Um, I'll keep you all updated with how this does. I know Monday is going to be a big day. You could see the day start off with a spike and then a sell off. You could even start off. You could even see the day start off with a big sell off and then the spike. Uh, let's see what happens. I'm just scared if brokers hold this stock. If they hold this stock, it's just going to be so annoying. I don't want to see no reverse blitz. I don't want to see this stock getting halted. Just keep it how it is. All right, let's see what happens with this. Thank you all for watching. Own Darren Research. Hope you enjoyed today's video. Let me know if you want to see more around these stocks. And yeah, bye-bye.